what up week nine of the training last week i uh messed up on saturday i was actually supposed to run nine miles but i only ran eight i looked at the schedule wrong um i was supposed to run eight this week so i'm just gonna keep it going i'm just gonna run eight again so i won't backtrack um today i have a quick three miles i have some new shoes on hopefully these are the ones that i wear during uh during the half marathon, San Diego half marathon. Um, I'm gonna try to break them in. See what happens, three miles. I'm gonna try to uh, go for, for speed this time. Try to keep it in the low eights, hopefully 8.15 or a little under, if not eight flat. I'm not sure if I'll be able to do it, but I'll definitely try. Like I always say, man, there's nothing to it but to do it, let go. Also, before I start, the way I mount my uh, my GoPro on my chest, I have a little adapter for an extra battery pack. And the way it's set up, it, it hits the back part of it, the, the bracket. So it looks like I'm actually facing down when I'm running. Um, so that's the only problem. However, I'll probably like grind it off or something. Um, I'll, I'll see what I can do. I don't want to mess with it too much because I don't want it to break off. But um, I'll definitely try something, see what happens. What up? I just knocked out my uh, my three mile run. I'm not gonna lie, when I got home today after work, definitely didn't feel like running today. It's windy, it's a little overcast, a little cloudy, a little cold, but I'm definitely glad I uh, I got out and got it, got it done. Um, definitely met my goal. I was trying to go under eight minutes per mile, ran the three miles. Um, I'm not sure if you guys can see this, but, uh, let me see. Three miles at a 740 average total time, 2310. Um, definitely not bad. Um, now that I think of it, I should have gone the extra 0 0.02 to make it a complete 5k. But, um, next time for now, I'm happy. Definitely happy. I, uh, I got to wear my new shoes, even though they're the same model, same everything as uh, the last ones I was running in. Basically what happened is they went on sale, so I stocked up and uh, brought them out today, break them in before the uh, San Diego Half Marathon. <laughs> What up y'all? I just went ahead and uh, knocked out my Thursday run. Today is March 5th. I ran three on Monday, four on Wednesday, and today's Thursday, which was my uh, my three mile run. As I mentioned last time, today I'm on my schedule. Uh, I'm supposed to be ramping down, which is what I'm doing. Um, the funny thing is that on Monday, I went ahead and had a, a 740 pace per mile when I ran the three yesterday. It jumped up to 7.55, and then today is 8.05 per mile average. Um, 
So I've been increasing 15 seconds each mile. Uh, today, I'm, I'm gonna be honest, I was pretty tired. Um, one of the things that uh, people forget to do is get enough sleep. I haven't been getting enough sleep this week, so I've been completing my runs, but I've been a little tired. Um, part of it is just I haven't been sleeping. So there's really nothing, no other excuse. I just need to increase my, uh, my sleep. Um, I haven't been uh, recording them as much because they're kind of boring. So I'll try to make a little uh, better videos as the week progresses for now. I'll do eight miles on sun Saturday, and then I think that'll that'll finish off my week. Like I always say, there's nothing to it but to do it. Peace. What up? Just a quick update on my run for uh, for March, the San Diego Half Marathon. Um, I decided that I'm not going to be doing the uh, the run um, as of March. I think it was like the third or second. I decided that I'm not going to be participating in the run. Um, the reason I'm not going to be doing the run is because um, there's uh, going to be a lot of people. Um, currently, we are going through this little, uh, or not little, but um, the coronavirus. Um, I think in a race where there's going to be thousands of people that may be flying in to do the race, who may have been in other parts of the world because of work or whatever, they may show up to the race. Um, and any wave that I enter, it's going to consist of uh, a bunch of people in a close area, um, sweating, coughing, breathing heavily. So that's a perfect uh, place to get a uh, to get one of those uh, coronavirus or infected dro droplets into my into my body, and um, that would not be good. Um, I don't think I would necessarily die from the virus. Um, I'm pretty young and pretty healthy for the most part. Um, so I don't think I would die from it, but I would not want to be in quarantine, uh, all by myself. Um, I think that would be, yeah, that, that would, that would suck. Um, for, for a few reasons, mainly because I would be all alone, basically in isolation, um, without anything to do. And then also I would miss work. Um, I am concerned with work because I do plan out my days or my weeks, I should say, in advance, and I make uh, different appointments at work. So I would have uh, a bunch of people coming in to see me and I would not be able to, uh, to be there since my, uh, my job is mainly um, appointment-based. Um, so that's one of the things, you know, I don't want to be that, that douchebag who just ends up, you know, not being, being at work and having my, uh, my clients not be there or have not be there for my clients, basically. Um, so that's the main thing. Um, like I said, um, the race would put me in, in a greater, at greater risk, and um, that's the main thing I don't want to be. Uh, I don't want to be isolated um, or in isolation or, or quarantined. Um, either way, I am happy that I went ahead and, uh, and did the training, did the work. Um, it's a lot of fun. Got to run a couple of, uh, a, a few days with, uh, with my boy, heavy miles, heavy workouts. And yeah, it's part of it, you know? Um, it only uh, makes me stronger, it only keeps me healthier. Uh, for now, uh, I'm gonna continue to run, obviously. So we'll see uh, when uh, when I run again. Um, definitely, we'll keep you guys updated. Um, but yeah, that's, uh, that's pretty much it. Oh, and as of March, what was it, March 12th on Thursday, this past Thursday, um, the race was, uh, was suspended. Um, it became a virtual race where everybody was going to run individually um and they were going to do it that way um which is which is fine i just uh i just wanted to do the actual race you know just be there with uh with the crowds and with the people but obviously that's not a that's not the best thing to do as a as right now you know people are saying to avoid large crowds and whatnot so anyway there's nothing to it but to do it peace let go we are the music makers and we are the dreamers of dreams. Mm -hmm.